All right, welcome back everyone. Mean Poo here. And today we're going to try out the game called Avoid Bastard. So, the stars, I have you want to pronounce it. Uh, from what I've been reading, it's a first-person shooter with some uh, roguelike elements. And it has like a little comic book feel to it. So, let's jump in and see what's available in the options. Oh, Graphics department, red 1080, full screen, yes, fantastic quality, FOV. I never changed um, FOV. I might have changed it once or twice in my lifetime on a game. But anyway, it's on 60, gamma 10, brightness for the border. Looks like we can change that to dark, black, whatever. Uh, V-Sync is off, frame skip, no. And let's hit apply just to make sure everything sticks. All right, let's go on back. All right, so let's go ahead and start a new game. This is stock settings, difficulty normal. The DLCs, like it's all ready. And let's go ahead and hit next. his bloody checkpoint. Well, file 61P to head office. Unfulfilled delivery of resources. If it's in the Sargasso Nebula, clients have all been lost anyway, eh? Yeah, I think so. Let's log off and get rat arsed instead. So it saves. I'm ready. Whoops, a Daisy. It looks like you've run out of bullets. Ammunition requests can be filed at the Void Arc. Oh dear, return to the Void Arc is currently prohibited. This prohibition will be lifted when you obtain the line printer, or in the event of your death. Whoops. Oh, I see some green over here. Usually, uh, green you know, the line printer is lets you know that there's something the to be found. Tubes? All right, so let's make our way over to the cubes. ETA for arrival of supply vessel, three days. Probability of survival for three days, 8%. And I'm looking over here on the left side, the 79 FPS. I do know when I booted it up before, uh, you'll get well over a hundred. So, you know, as long as it's over 60, it's fine. Plus, you know, I'm streaming, so you can expect some frame loss. oh and regulations require you to avoid being incinerated by gunpoints. Let's try to loot everything we can. trouble locating items why not use your local mapping device we're here Come on. All right, so we're trying not to get shot and loot everything we can. Well done. I'll be sure to note this requisition of a line printer in your parole hearing. Return to the Steve is now recommended. So 
some other stuff. Right associated with dangerous occurrences is approaching. Might I suggest a rapid evacuation? You know, let's go straight across and see what's there. And then we'll come out and make a right. Well, looks like it's empty. Nothing we can use. Addendum. The vessel is docked and dangerous occurrences are now imminent. Looks like we lost the survivors. Dearest, we have to, like, ship. unlock this? Whoa. Okay. Excellent. Return to the Void Arc is now possible. Note to self. Issue more bullets to replacement client. Okay, so it expected us to die. Alright. So, sort of like a tutorial, so to speak. Steve cleared for return to Void Arc. P forty five filed. Steve cleared for docking. All right. Pretty interesting so far. Violations have resulted in a premature end of life situation. Recruiting replacement client. Oh. Issuing WCD client care package. So, congratulations. You have been selected to assist with an emergency staff turnover. So you're a clone. Okay, so this is probably where the rogue elements come in. I'm just going to assume if you died, then you come back as somebody else. Welcome to your induction seminar. Unauthorized persons have boarded this vessel and rendered it inoperative. Your action item, restart the FTL drive. Okay, I need to see your citizen card to authorize the restart. As a WCG penal client, your citizen card has been shredded. Don't worry, you'll find parts to construct another one from on nearby vessels. The parts you need are a line printer and an ID card. Hmm. Once you have the parts, you can assemble them on the Steve's workbench. Okay, so let's check out this. Right, so the regulator is our gun. Enforces regulations uh, via a bullet, of course. And this looks like some items that we can unlock later or build, since it's a workbench. And this is our character. Let's move this out of the way for just a second. The name is Stevens or C. Stevens. Inventory, we have nothing in our inventory. Our status. Our uh, health is full. We have enough fuel for one jump, three days of food, and 30 merits. 
and that's the currency for authorization and purchases no warp keys torpedoes or heart starters and i'm going to guess and say the heart starter is probably something like if you die then it'll bring you back or something like that uh, we have 48 bullets and our bio it says uh chester stevens he's a prisoner and offenses is causing all of fact what is it what is that olfactory distress to a cnt executive okay and uh he's a smoker so he randomly coughs alerting enemies and it says down here rehydration approved so that would explain when they take the little packet out and um uh, rehydrate the person to take on this new mission which is probably what they're doing to real prisoners anyway <laughs> All right, so uh, looking over here, it says action needed. Inoperable after a uh, pirate attack, uh, the WCG Void Arc floats helplessly in the Sargasso Nebula. BACS requires a human with a valid citizen card to restart the FTL drive. Okay, so this says up extra upgrades. We don't have anything. Go back to core upgrades and let's go to the star map. Valued client, please follow the bouncing arrow to the line. Okay, so we have a map and this is where we have to go. Our path that we need to take, I guess we can take any path we can to get to the uh, line printer. Okay, let's start here. We'll burn one fuel and eat one food if we go here, which that's the only way we can go because we can't go that way. And it says, um, Pack Bus Skiff Righteous Lance features bushwhackers and bolts. And it detects a uh, bus box. And it lets us build the bushwhacker, of course. And some enemies that we're going to find are uh, a few screws and a few janitors. So let's head over there. Did you notice that there's a buzz box on this vessel? Requisitioning it would not be substantively illegal. Now, I do know when you do land on these vessels, you have a certain amount of air. So I, I try to be a completionist sometimes. So I'm going to try to get as much as I can before I refill on air, if we can find it and get out. So let's dock and go. Get our regulator. It's the only weapon we have. And board. Try to go as fast. So we're going to start here. And we're going to make our way this way. But sometimes it's better to go straight around and go to the helm and see what's up in there. Straight down here. This way. I'm going to go straight through two doors and make a left. Let's do that. Nebula has caused citizens to assume irregular forms. I'm sure no one would blame you for murdering them. All right. Our enemies. This WCG worker is colloquially known as a screw. Given your capabilities, an attempt to murder him would almost certainly fail. Lost? Fuel and part locations can be downloaded at the helm. All right, so let's uh, go out of here, go two doors and straight down and check that room. Looks like that cough is going to give us away.
launch. Ha ha ha! Cool, cool. Alright, so we can get those. Seed needs fuel, though. Perhaps you could look for some. I think that's all that's in here. So. Try to shoot us. Oh, we just left out of here. Stay low, let's stay low. So we have around, around five minutes worth of oxygen. Pretty good. Looks like there's one more. What is that? It's a treasure. Loot. Looks like it's the way we came. good Bushwhacker, once armed, explodes when enemies move near it. So build it. No doubt you were wondering, what happens when I die? Don't worry, other clients will make good use of any items you've constructed. Well, that's nice to know. Why is this nebula a desolate void filled with derelict vessels? Unauthorized persons have boarded these vessels and requisitioned parts from them in an unauthorized fashion. <laughs> All right, so we have two that we can choose from. Uh, this one has some tourists and some juvies, and it says it has some of both. This one, some janitors and some outpatients, a few and some, so... Uh... Can we build anything? Therapy provides new traits, bullets, zap charges, and slag. I don't even know what none of that is. Marriage, staples, and plas. Let's let's go this way. Stay at the top. And let's dock. Alright, we're taking our firearm. And the bushwhacker. And then I'm going to assume that our ammunition is limited, so we have to, like, be careful. Alright, this is a big one. So we do know that the FTL area has gas or fuel, so... We want to head over that way, and we do know that the helm has the maps uh, for everything we need. So maybe we could go this way, right? Get the information we need, swing around in this area, go around, come around, get some oxygen, and then make our way around, get the gas, 
come back and get out. I don't know if it's going to work that way, but uh, we can we can try. And and I know I, I I'm going to get disoriented, so bear with me. Welch. Uh-oh. Hold on now. Man, I got hit from that. Oh, shoot. Come on. this you know that sail shading this oh, we miss a lot of stuff <laughs> oh I ran in something Okay, look like we're doing uh, pretty good so far. There's a middle here. Go ahead and head up to the top. Whoa, it's a gun. me security system is restored additional cleaning activities may result in that thank you for your cooperation WCG imposes severe penalties for self-asphyxiation. You can requisition supplementary oxygen in Atmo modules. We got about three minutes. Nothing in here. Somebody's coming. So they have a blast radius. You got to watch out for that. So far, so good. Nothing's in here. I'm 
want to search all of this before we move out. Whoa. Nothing there, nothing. Should have got me anyway. Where's that oxygen in? Failure to provide maximum cooperation to WCG guards is punishable by. Subsections 484 F. Oh, at least you can pick it back up. Awesome. Where is that oxygen at? Alright, goody, goody. Okay, so... Up. So that turns the power off. We need that. this deposit deposit get five merits but if we let's deposit to squirrels but we can use the junk when we get back uh, to our home our base uh, to build stuff but you can also buy things with your merit. Look like we cleared this place out. All right. So we can build the stapler now. Let's build that. This is exciting. Your KPIs are really trending up. And it looks like at the bottom, it tells you exactly what it needs. Like a MED blower, uh, surgery four dummies whatever that is and a neutral tray all right so so far so good let's head on over all right we have a parts uh, menu as well you 
nothing there. Okay, so here or here? Security is de deactivated, and gunpoints and peepers are inactive. And we have some janitors. Here we have some janitors and a few of the outpatients. Nothing gets built here. It has some merits and staples and the plaz. And we can get food and all materials here. And we can build the fast whacker zapper if we find the right stuff. I think we should go here. I'm gonna take this regulator since it has more bullets. So no, um, no security. Those those gun turrets won't be working. And it's probably pointless to go to the helm. Let's see if there's some power. Let's see. Oops. No power, so we shouldn't go to the helm. It's not going to do any good. We need to go left. Looks like, what is this right here? Restores power. We can make a zigzag up there. We can make a zigzag go around and come back maybe grab some gas some oxygen and swing back around <sighs> hmm I guess if I'm fast enough I can just zigzag our way up to the generator and then work back around let's see how well it goes thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go down this long hallway and I'm going to search the suite area. Wasting bullets. Somewhere behind me. You can get stuck on some things.
Heading for the habit straight ahead. Please do not molest the janitorial staff. Remember, they're here to clean up your mess. What's that? So I just used that machine to purge the uh, slippery stuff that was on my body. Surely those aren't like um, spawning substances. Like they can just come back and you know the puddle in the ground of whatever that substance is. Three minutes of hit. air. Looks like we missed something over here in the habitat, but I think we'll be okay. We missed something in the dining, but I'm not going back in there. Or we got 154 health. It's not even worth it. Let's go straight ahead and go ahead and grab that in the garb area. like we cleared it out heading to the FTL so far that's right the guns guns are deactivated we're good this guy doesn't have any melee combat or anything like that but it looks like it'll take probably 15 shots to kill We could be a completionist and go back around, but like I said, I'm not going back in the dining area and I'm not going around to the habitat. We're good. Hey, uh, 
see. Akash uh, mentioned something. What do you say? Uh, was thinking of buying this on Steam and want to see how the performance on the Nitro Five. Thanks for the video. You think it's worth the price? Or oh, wait for sale? Wait for sale. I got it while it was on sale. Right now it's like twenty nine dollars. It is fun, uh, but definitely, definitely wait for sale. I think it's a little expensive. And it looks like we're gonna have to go <laughs> back through the dining, but I think we can uh, run right through it really fast. And the, as far as FPS, you will get more than what you see on the screen. Uh, it's cut down by a significant a lot. I'll say at least 20, 20 FPS because, because of the, um, the stream. I'm gonna swing. Uh, I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna get this right here. We're already here. Open. Come on, man. There was a perk that I was reading about that lets you exit from any airlock, and I wish I had it. Yeah, I got a little nervous there. I thought a spider was on my face, but you know, it's cold in my house and I got this blanket on my head, so. Whew. All these fingers. Build the zapper, stuns targets. WCG rewards proactive work. I'm making a note for your parole hearing. Those deep lacerations PAL detects are no doubt uncomfortable. Did you know that emergency medical care is available in Zonox vessels? Zonox vessels. Is that what that is right here? Anyway, I got like 122 health. And you know, you don't have to like go, you can like actually rest. I'll gain 25 and eat a, you know, eat some food. I got, you know, 11 days worth. But let's see what's here. Nothing. We got a few of the screws and some jewies. I hate those things. So Jews or whatever you want to call them. Um, burn one fuel, eat one food, gain 25 health. And 25 to 75 merits. Uh, let's rest. I mean, I really need some health here. I'm afraid if I go there, I'm going to die. So I'm going to rest. And... Let's go here. Okay, you spot an official CNT envelope floating here. Inside is a card that reads, Congratulations, second runner up in the tidiest locker of the month challenge. There's also a small collection of merits tucked into the card. 52 merits gained. Okay, cool. We didn't have to do anything. That's great. All right. Man, that looks like a big one. But we're on track for here. And it looks like there's an oil leak and it's going to be slippery. So what that does is it's like Mario, uh, like a Mario game. If you run and you, you're on ice, you're going to slide a little bit. It's going to be hard to stop. There's a warp key cache somewhere. Here is a... Uh, 
the O2 lasts longer and there's no junk junk not in containers but it's messy and you have some janitors and some screws hmm a few janitors okay we should go here because this is going to give us some new traits if we're able to find some so let's go to this big one here we go Messy. What does messy mean? Okay. Um, we're going to head to the helm. Let's get some information. What we're up against and we'll swing back around into the FTL area. man Hello? sure takes a long time for the for it to, to detonate you know Place infiltrated with sticky feet. It says can't be knocked back. Remove smoker. Oh yeah, we need this. Leave from any airlock. Trying to tell me that missed. Life support systems suck, man. <laughs> Trapped. Okay. Um. There was one way in here. Or two ways, but one way in, then we got to go back around. Sandwich. 
Okay. Bullets. I'm gonna keep that locked. Get up. Okay, oxygen's in here, but we have plenty. Okay, we killed that guy. Apparently we didn't. Oh man, there's a gump turret. Killed itself. Okay, um. Let's get any. Straight across. Okay, no more fuels in here so we can head on to the garbage area and get out Barb. I really wish I could have got into that one room that had all of those bullets because we really need them. Shoot. Is that stomp, stomp, stomp? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, my God. Get out of here. We get. Okay. Let's swing back around here and then go out. So we'll go turn around. Oh, that's the way we just left. We try to lock them in there. We're gonna have to go this way. All the way back around. Or we can let him follow us and then swing around. He's here. I'm not messing with that guy. We can't afford it.
straight ahead. We got everything. <laughs> Woo. At least we got that trait. Help finding the parts required to build these useful items. You need a part locator. Please check the parts locker for a glow bulb to build one with. Are you looking for a glow bulb? Because the Steve is all out of those. Okay, let's employ some out of the box thinking. A glow bulb could be constructed from plas and biomaterials. I'm surprised that you're hanging around here looking at that glow bulb when you could be at the workbench building a part locator. Impressive. Now activate locate mode to find the parts needed for an item you desire really don't know what I want or what I need so um, toaster charges uh, to fire a burst of polarized light passes through enemies and windows Ooh. Well, I don't know how to use it but Okay, locate mode. Some shoes. Decreases oil slip. 25% of jumps don't consume fuel. Adds 150 health. Yes, we need that. Smart thinking. The Steve will now display a green arrow guiding you to the required parts. Wow. Okay. So we need to <laughs> Okay, I'm going to I'm going to uh rest for just a second. We have 11 days worth of food, so go ahead and go up. Just Man, this is getting rough. Now, from what I understand, you don't have to go in if you don't want to. Lots of slippery oil. Subverted security. All securities is subverted. Let's go here. We're, we're here. We might as well just go on in. I mean, but we have 90, 95 health, man. That's, that's not a lot. Let's rest one more time and go on in. And then we can dock. here by the dine straight up make a right here 
Oh. Objective. Restore power. And we need to get the XTC stem. So the power is going to be over by the generator. So we have to... Wow. Wow. If we can, we might as well clear out the end. You know what? Let's just go. No power, so we can't do anything. Oh, it sucks so bad. Can't lock any doors. Oh, we don't run into a monster. We're gonna have to go back on this FTL room. Passengers using XTC stims are questioning. Well, those guys are strong. Oh, come on. This is oil. Okay, I got it. I think I have to pay to get it open.
Come on, come on. Close to some oxygen. Whoa, slippery man. Okay. All right, we can go out. Let's go towards the FTL and go straight down. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Wow. Man, that was so close. Did he say George? Okay. Is it clear? No, it's one more in the habitat area. Is it even worth going in? close by the door. Here it is. Just missed it. Okay. I believe there is a gun turret somewhere. Jesus. I'm slipping. Let's get out of here. I think we're good. Yeah, we don't need to get the rest. All right. It's getting rough. It's really getting rough. We picked up some th three foods, three sandwiches. Up some sandwiches. <laughs> can we build bullets? That's what can we build some freaking bullets? Fuel scavenger. It's this right here. Okay. All right, let's go ahead and build this gun. Hold on, padded jacket. Okay, so we're we're on the way to build the padded jacket. That's why it has the looks like the green clover or the X marks the spot because we I think we have one more jump to make. Let's build that. This is, but can't build it. You know that either. The line printer is where we're headed to go. It's like the main mission. All right. So we're headed here. Once we get out of this, we can get that padded jacket. Gives us 150 more health points. I'm going to go ahead and rest because we are really, really, really low on health. 
Hey, look at that. The DNA strand flying around up there. Randomizes a trait. Matter of fact, let's see what traits we have. We can leave a vessel from any airlock, which is the best. And infiltrator. More slowly detected by peepers and gunpoints. Hmm. And I still randomly cough because I'm a smoker. All right, let's go on in. And what we're up against, we have a, a few of the screws and those outpatients. Man, gosh, I think I think we're running low on those bombs, so we got to be careful. We have six left. You know, I would take this, but we just don't have enough ammunition. And this is such a weak weapon. I'm just gonna have to uh, rely on my bushwhackers. Hey, hi, Inferno. Oh, I use the... Uh, uh, what my it's the uh, blue yeti but it's black i'm sorry i didn't see your comment dude and uh maniac maniac game it gets more fps than what you see on the screen i uh, expect to have around 100 fps while you're playing i mean like it wouldn't really make a difference what you know what you see but it you know you will get about 100 fps while playing so what we need to do is we need to get the restraint pad and we have two exits first thing we need to do we either need to go to the ftl to get gas or we can go to the helm to find out where all the loot locations are and since we're low on you know ammunition <laughs> yeah one second bear with me Okay. Alrighty. Left. Then we can follow up with O2 on the way around. It's going to be very complicated. Holy! Woo! Man, did you guys see that? Man, this guy's not playing. That hover, it means someone is walking around. Oh my goodness. We can't have anybody sneaking up on our backs. What? That music. Somebody seeing us? I mean, the music doesn't start for nothing. I hear a lot of feet. A lot of feet.
We gotta get in that helm. We really don't need to get in that helm, but can't afford to let that. Oh shh, son! Holy cow, I've never been like caught up like this. Okay, where are we? We are here. There's the part right there. <sighs> we really need that gas to do this. That was the part that freaking blows, man. All of those parts we had. Steve cleared for return to Voidark. Do we get to keep any of the parts about the food or anything? P-45 filed. Steve cleared for docking. Oh man, that sucks. NS violations have resulted in a premature end of life situation. Recruiting replacement client. Issuing WCG client care package. Fifty percent of the time when resting, he rests an extra day. He's sleepy. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> and he's sticky fingers, so he automatically picks up stuff. So we won't have to be. <laughs> I really don't want to do this. I mean, I'm pissed right now because of that. And he's starving. Let's just see. I mean, how bad could it be? Cool. Congratulations. You have been selected to assist with an emergency staff turnover. And we got so far. The parts you need are a line printer and an ID card. Feel free to use these items constructed by a former client. A little scrubbing with bleach should remove the blood stains. <laughs> The blood stains. <laughs> All right. Can we build anything? No. What parts do we have? Do we have any? Four parts. Uh, workbench. All right. Well, looky here. It's still telling us we need to go here to get that padded jacket. Though it's a, a different map, we're okay, I guess. I'll, I'll play for a bit just to see how far we can get. Man, but that blows, man. We were so close. One second. All right, we have no bullets for that. 18 bullets for this. Here we go. I mean, sometimes you gotta actually, do you really need the map from the helm? You know, you need food and gas more. So we're looking for the buzz box. Let's check out the sticky fingers, see how that works. 
Oh yeah, it works just fine. It's gotta be another way. Fortunately not, but look, look at the stars. Oh man, this aiming. Man, this guy's got dead aim. They ramp up the difficulty or what? Stuck. Twenty five marathon. No, it's probably not. Even Apparently, it's something. It's a part of some kind. buzz box man it doesn't even give you a chance to move just freaking wow man Can't go out that way. We gotta go all the way back down that hall. Whew. Well, and I don't see any. Is that oxygen in here?
up and around. we gonna get past that <sighs> swear Hello, Jayden. Welcome to the channel, my man. And it's not going good right now. And I got lit up. Found a lot of stuff, though. CG meet its obligations as a good corporate citizen. It might also get you the materials you want to build the things you actually need. Hey, here's the padded jacket. Which we need. break I I am hearing a large thump 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 GPU is idle? Uh, what's... What do you mean is it's idle? You mean like a game is not uh, using your... Your GPU? Is that what you're trying to say? Wow, the part is way over here. Yeah. 
here. Way around. Get some oxygen. Where is it? I don't see it. Oh, okay, here it is. Jeez, where'd he come from? How many of these guys are on this freaking rig? Guys, did you see that, man? Big, huge mother... <sighs> so I'm going to swing back around, go down the long hall, uh, swing up through the helm, and get this part. Part. Where's the part? All clients, please open your feeding hatch. Continental breakfast, cheese, and onion sandwich. And detect power outages before entering a vessel. Remove sleepy. So apparently we got the part already. So let's clear out this room and get out. So how does it perform in games? If it says it's idle, how does it perform in games? Is it, is it is your GPU actually working? Open Nitro Sense, the GPU is discreet. GPU is idle. But I, I know what you're saying there, but are you trying to figure out if your GPU is working? Is that what you're, you're trying to find out? I haven't had that problem before, but um, I'll look into it for you. If I find out anything, I'll post about it. I'm trying to find something to build.
This is what I should have been finding. All of this. Can I pick more than one? Nope. Wow, I'm I'm way off. <laughs> I'm way off. But it looks like uh we can go some different places. Maybe we could pick something else to find. Maybe this. Nope. Everything's so far out of reach. I don't I don't know what I could actually look for to build. Everything is so far out of reach. Let's get some trainers. What's this full scavenger? Let's try that and see what Whew. Let's just say forget it and just go, right? Let's find some uh, I don't want to mess with any screws. Uh, here's, let's go here. There's hardly there's some some janitors. Let's go here. Powers out. Not good. Looks like the power. No, the power's on. My bad. My bad. Lucky bits. Talk about not alone. Dude, just he he took a lucky pot shot. These guys. There's no way to get into that FTL. I know how we can get in. Will a bomb blow it up? Gentlemen, a laning mechanic.
really happy to. It looks like they're, they're waiting for the show. And I'm slipping all over the place. Oxygen at fifty percent. So, um, our part straight up. Hey, we can get out now. But we really need that fuel. I'm gonna go in this atmosphere area and uh, get some air. The Mo2. Right in this area. No more fuel? This is one more. This? Let's get off this trash can. Let's check our bio. Oh man, so it replaced our sticky finger trait. It's gone. It's freaking gone. Oh, and you know what? The Boy Scout trait actually worked because it said I downloaded something already, downloaded the map for the area, and I didn't even download it yet. I was wondering what was going on there. Hey, Jack Ryan, what's up, man? Oh, yeah, I can build some pieces. Right? Swagger. Oh. These planets are getting exotic. 
at those. It looks like a freaking mine. Hey, what is this? Fuel cells. Now let's head this way. All right. Sun uncapped fuel cells are floating here, leaking precious fuel, possibly tossed overboard by fume sniffing juvies. In any case, you're able to siphon a little fuel on what's left. Four fuel gained. That's great. I can always use more fuel. We can get a random part and. What do you mean, cost? All food? No, I'm not ready to risk all of my food just for a random part. No. From a hungry hermit. No, let's... What's this? Go here and it takes 50 to 150 health? No, it's not. No. No way. Or, we can fight a lot of those freaking outpatients. Oh man, we are really stuck. not cool at all i mean i don't like fa fighting those outpatients it says it's just a few of them but <sighs> let's go i mean i can't give up everything we got stock i like the bushwhacker weapon that that actually works fairly simple but looks can be deceiving you know med blower is what we're looking for no mini map available o2 supply consumed faster we gotta book it <laughs> book it Shoots up all our weapons, ammunition. Oh, suck. But at least we're able to get one fuel out of it. Oh, we got two minutes worth of air left. Hey, where's the oxygen? Look at that. Oxygen at 50%. Okay, where to next? Um... Let's just get off of here. Really don't like this place. Whoops. Your wellness at 
adventure starts and ends with Sonics. I'm gonna wind up dying messing around on that one. We got some food, we got some fuel. It's better than nothing. Oh, and we got the MED blower. Yeah. That's what we came for anyway. Man, that looks huge, doesn't it? Burn one fuel, eat one food. Many tourists and a few scribes. Um, we haven't met any scribes yet. <laughs> I can only imagine. We can go here or here. I just don't want to risk all that extra. We're going to have to go this way. Let's go. Take care of that TFK. Look like you got it under control, my man. Which is uh, it's actually a weird problem if the GPU is idle. What I was wanting to know is, if you play a game, is your GPU being used? I mean, can you actually tell? You have to play a, a GPU intensive game, like play Tomb Raider or something like that. To tell if it's actually working if not it probably won't even start or it it you know it would just be like really really slow because it's using the integrated uh intel chip uh, but you might want to go into nvidia panel and actually make sure that it's being used with the exe that you're trying to start And these these uh spaceships are just getting really strange. A boss. We got a boss. We got a boss. Dispenses torpedoes. Where Nux are armed and deployed. Good source of cluster flags. We got a boss. We need to head here, here. We need to get the detonator. Smoke right up. Man, are you serious with this? I'm just gonna keep that there just in case. Yeah, I got somebody. I'm not liking this at all. Rod. What's that? What? Seriously? Did, did that thing say it's going to end your life? Oh, shoot. It said it's coming. 
shortly and it's going to end your life. <laughs> God, man, that scared me for real. I'm going to end your life shortly. Okay, the part is up there. So we can uh, go straight ahead. What is it? What is it? Freaking what? Cheat. Cheating. Not liking this. Okay, we we have a gun over here. Oxygen freak. How am I gonna get this? Um, Wrong way, wrong way. I can't fill out that form until I have form six OB. What is that? Got the detonator. So should I leave? We can get out of here. Okay, straight down. No, there's something, something right here. It's a part. We got four minutes of oxygen. We're gonna have to try to, I'm gonna have to try to beat this. Can I get it? Unlock it. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on.
I end up. Life support systems critical. Two door right. <laughs> we about died, man. We get anything we can build. Can we build anything? But we couldn't build some health, you know, some health packs. Health packs would work right now. Okay, what is this? Um, slag pal, 20 to 60 slag. Let's just go ahead and get it. I'm gonna gain 35 health. The STEV or Steve collides with a pile of metal parts, possibly the remnants of a destroyed vessel, or perhaps just some junk a janitor threw out. Either way, it can be recycled into some useful slag. Alright. Let's go ahead and rest. That might help us out. We got enough for three days. O2 supply lasts longer. Security deactivated. Vending machines buy and sell. We don't have that much money, though. And we don't want to fool with those guys. That zapper really comes in handy. I actually just started using it the last two missions. Wow. I can only imagine. What does K mean? Vend? It's like a little store. Dispense items for merits. Dispense items for merits. Okay, let's take a look. Scare me there. Hey, it's a it's a video store like called Trail Mart. Sell twenty votes. I owned thirty-eight. Uh twenty. And it's by some few somebody's walking around. A sandwich. Got some ammo. Yeah. I can't use any of that. What about this? We can buy some spikes, some fingers, cluster. 
Did I just buy something that's like unusable? It's a dirty bathroom. A reliable miner. <laughs> yeah, it's a it's a bruh moment, man. I'm out. I have nothing else to buy. I don't have any money. At least we got what we spent. As far as fuel and food. On to the next one. This is the ID ship. And we have a few spooks. <laughs> some spooks. And some outpatients. And it says the WCG therapy brig features therapy. Okay, features. And then it says therapy colon provides new traits, bullets, zap charges, and slag. And it builds our citizen card, which we need. Yeah, we need some food, run reliable. All right, so I am going to, I'm going to rest. I mean, just to get, get us some more health. And let's go ahead and jump in. Wow. We use up our food. <laughs> all we we just need the part, that's all we need. Nothing else, just the part. So we got cameras now. Didn't get to check it out last time, but uh, yeah, we got cameras now. This big headed thing. What? What? My bomb detonated on me, or did it, was it because that those guys got like too close through the glass? Are you tired of it? That's not fair. I, I, I call that cheating. That's. So I'm going to take that back. I think it was because I got too close, and they got really close, and. Um, I got caught up in the, the radius. Those are some ugly somethings. Peeper. All right, there's a helm over here. Yeah. 
We just need a card made. That's all we need. All right. Peace is over there. under my care. I care for you the most. 50%. Is this what we need? Oh, well, I guess we already got it. Um, somehow we, we got it, so... Uh, we probably need to head over to this atmosphere area and then to the FTL, but it's only like one field over there. I say that we get out of here and trek through the tombs and just get out. Where are those missing pieces? They were in the right area? No. Complete opposite side. And we can't get this because I am not paying 50 for that. All right, so what does this card do for us? You now have all the parts required to forge a new citizen card. On second thoughts, let's avoid the forge word in our future discussions. Picked up a spoon. Okay, so... How do we, uh... How do we build that card? Action item. It says, uh, inoperable after a pirate attack, the WCG Void Arc floats helplessly in the Sargasso Nebula. BACS or BAX requires a human with a valid citizen card to restart the FTL drive. So... Okay. That was simple. <laughs> I just clicked it. Employee retention protocols require me to state the following. Wow. Now, let's return to the Void Arc and restart the FTL drive. In recognition of your behavioral competency, WCG is delighted to offer you a sentence reduction of 16 days. Mm. This reduction will largely offset the sentence for counterfeiting a citizen card. What? Oh dear. It looks like you've tried to use an unregistered citizen card. Did you forget to register your citizen card with HR? I'm sorry. Do you want to use the HR computer? Because that would require the HR computer <laughs> to have not been stolen. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm sure you can find the parts to construct one. HR's out the door. <laughs> Uh, reminds me of work. Please contain your excitement while I issue you a bonus client care package. Really? The Stanley Parable narrator? I thought it sounded familiar. Your action items. Obtain a tactical computer, a wiring diagram, and a mouse ball, but don't neglect your work-life balance. In other words, don't forget about food. Oh, okay, so... 
I see what this game is doing. Okay, it does have some roguelike elements. You die, you come back as someone else. You can, you can, uh, it'll come back with a set of traits, or you can play the game. And while you're discovering and looking around on these uh, derelict ships, you can gain some more traits or replace the ones that you have. And to continue the story, something happens and then it sends you on another random mission. But it's not like a random mission because you really need it. So, you know, I've been playing this for how long? Uh, two hours and 20 minutes. Pretty, pretty long enough. Um, so you get the gist of what's going on with the game. Pretty decent game. Sale shading like. Uh, wait for sale if you're going to buy this game. I mean, because it does have some replay value. I did see some of the same layouts of the ship, but it did start to change on the last two missions. And that's pretty much about it. I like the, the narrator's voice. I like the humor in it. And it seems like there's probably going to be some more enemies that you, you know, you could fight. And I'm pretty sure there are other traits that we didn't come up on. I can only remember like three or four of them to be specifically. And uh, look like there's some other things that you can like build like this kitty bot and a banger and the toast hunter and all that other stuff. Plus, there's, you know, these, these extra upgrades you can get and no telling what else, what other mission they're going to send you on uh, to keep the story going. But in a nutshell, this is a pretty decent game. Uh, time to, it, It'll keep you busy and play it when uh, you have some downtime. Like you want to, you know, play a game for like 15, 20 minutes. This would be your game right here, because if you die then the next person can pick up and um, take the mantle where you left off. Pretty decent. So with that, I appreciate everybody watching the stream and everybody that's in here. And uh, I'm gonna stop and uh, take a break. And for the rest of you guys out there, take care. It's been Mean Poo. Peace.